Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some packy. I have the Mucho Nacho Cheese. And I have Cool Salsa Verde. These were $3.50 each at the Fresh Market. Um, and people ask us often, uh, have you ever tried the ghost pepper? And uh, Andrew and Kevin tried that. We've tried it, it's awful. Uh, yeah, they, yeah, they, nobody wants to be tortured like that. I so, mean, if you like really hot food, then go for it. But yeah, yeah but if you they, don't, then don't do it. Right, but just we have tried us. that, so just know. Uh, it says all real, nothing artificial. They're certified gluten free, no artificial ingredients. It says bold by nature. We're packy, pronounced packy, and we do bold the natural way by only using real ingredients to create fierce flavors with nothing artificial ever. After all, our life and crispy chip recipe and our name is a tribute to the Aztecs that inspired us, and they weren't exactly known for compromising, so neither are we. Mine says the same thing. So, um, no artificial ingredients, flavors, preservatives. It's um, packy.com. Uh, it, there's cheese, cheese, and more cheese. 100% real ingredients. Seven servings are in this bag. Mm -hmm. One ounce, 28 grams, about 10 chips is 140 calories. That's exactly that. And the first ingredient in the bag is in, in these is ground corn. Yeah. I usually like their chips. They've got some other chips too. I like the I usually like the textures and flavors that they use. They're they're, they're good size. They are, they're huge. Because I was trying to find to find one. It looks like a Dorito. Yeah. I don't think all. I've ever I don't I may have had these, I don't remember. They're basically a Dorito. I like the flavor of the cheese though. It's really good. I like the texture. Those are not quite as spiced as a Dorito is, but has a really good cheese flavor. The texture is just like a Dorito. Oh yeah, same thing. So, yeah. So if you've never tried this brand, that's mm. what it tastes like. It tastes like a Dorito. Um, and I agree with the... No, I'm left with the spice though that tastes yes, as strong as Doritos. So. It's very similar. I do not think this as, is as cheesy as Doritos, mm -hmm. but you have to think that Doritos isn't using all natural ingredients. So for you're getting almost that exact same flavor in these and they're not using all those fake things. Yeah. So, they're very good. Yeah, they are. If you've never tried them before, try them. Yeah. But that's the ultimate. So if you <laughs> if you care, if that's important to you to not have artificial uh, flavors and all that, then go for They're it. Very, very yeah, this would be a good alternative to Dorito. And you're left with like a peppery kind of mm -hmm. flavor in your mouth. That's what you end with is like a this peppery. Yeah, it's not spicy like it will will burn, no, but no. there is the a little savory spice. Yeah, it's not. Yeah. I like that. All right, so these are the cool salsa verde, same calories. This one has a smooth hint of sour cream, uh, tangy tomatillo, and tart lime. I don't know about these because the lime. the lime. I like lime, but I don't like lime in with my chips. So I probably won't be crazy about them, but I'm willing to give them a try. You never know. You never know. know. You don't smell lime. I tell you what, you have this bag and it is hard to find one. I'm trying to find one that's not huge. And it's hard to find one in there that's not huge, which is good. I don't want one that little. <laughs> Give me a piece, like a for a three-year-old. Um, uh, I mean, that's a that's a good problem to have because normally you look at a bag of chips and, and they're, broken like, all the they're broken all the pieces. These these are just they're just they're just all bad. You just gotta break them or bite them. The lime's there, but it's not like super wow. strong. They're spicy, aren't they? I cannot believe I love that. Mm -hmm. These are good. They do have a hint of lime, so they do have a lime flavor. They do. These have just a little bit of a tingle in the back of your throat. Jalapeno pepper. That's what. Yeah, tomato powder, onion powder, garlic powder, jalapeno pepper, green chili pepper yeah. powder, tomatillo powder. Um, these are awesome. Those are good chips. If you like spicy, you have to like spicy. I know some of you cannot do spicy at all. You will want to avoid these. Yeah. They're very, very spicy. I, I, I couldn't have been more shocked. 
Yeah, because the lime mixes well with the flavor of the, the tomatillo and, and stuff like that, so it's really good. You probably have to have some of that lime to uh, offset the heat. Yeah. I think they're, I, they're not like burning, setting me on fire or anything, but there is a little tingle in the back Oh, my, my tongue, my, the whole layer of my tongue is like... See, habanero always hits you harder than it does me usually. But this has jalapeno. I thought it said habanero. No, jalapeno. The jalapeno is usually... Yeah, jalapeno me. pepper. Oh, jalapeno is usually hotter for me. I mean, I get a tingle in the back of my throat, but it's not like... And mine's on my tongue. Mine's, yeah, yeah mine's on my tongue. Not on the like back of my throat. Um, these are I the eat two, by itself chip. Out of the two, those are the ones I would buy again. Yeah, these you can eat by your, by themselves without doing anything. Those you could actually dip in them if you really wanted to, or you could just eat them by themselves. If you want them, if you want to add even more calories, you can dip them in nacho cheese. <laughs> How about bacon dip? <laughs> That'd be good too. Um, I think they're both good. Well, I'm just shocked because, well, it's just funny that That's right fun. before that I was telling everybody I don't like lime in my chips and normally I don't because I guess because typically you get the lime but you're not getting those spices. But with all those spices, I mean, it is an overload and I, I like mm -hmm. it. That is perfect. I'm going to tell you another difference between these and Doritos. Cause we're comparing to Doritos because that's the, the thing most people know. Yes, most people know Doritos. These are not as hard and sharp as a Dorito is. Right, true. So when you're biting them, they're a little softer. Not like, like soft, soft, but just they're easier to chew. Mm -hmm. And they don't have those sharp edges that, that a Dorito does. So maybe they have some more, a little bit more moisture in them or something. I don't know. It just makes them a little easier to eat. Well, I don't know if they have these at Walmart or not. They do sell this brand at Walmart. They sell the packy brand at Walmart because we've seen like the ghost pepper and mm -hmm. stuff like that. However, I don't know if they sell these kinds, uh, these uh, flavors. Right. The reason that they stood out at the fresh market is because these bags, the fresh market is very, very limited on what they sell. Do they even sell Lay's potato chips? Mm -hmm. No, never seen um, so when you see bags like this, they really stand out because they have different bags there. So I don't know if Walmart has these or not, but if they do, if you like spicy, you need to try these. Yeah, they're really, really, really good. And if you just like a Dorito type chip, but you would love, you've been looking for something more natural, then I would get the cheese because it's really good. good. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.